Hey guys, it's me. How you doing? So, I've been asked a question multiple times. <coughs> no, that wasn't it. Uh, it's, what distro do you daily drive? Yeah. I don't daily drive any distro. I just don't. I don't find a reason in it. Um, this is a Linux channel, and Linux is not just a single distro. It's multiple different distros. It's multiple different pack managers. And um, it ends up, uh, you know, being one of those things that if you're a Linux YouTube channel and you only want run, you only want run and teach one single distro, you're kind of limiting yourself and you're also doing a disservice to a lot of other people that will not choose that distro. Like I've seen channels that just teach Zorin. You're just teaching Ubuntu with a Z. And there's channels that just dedicated to teaching Mint. I don't know what Mint needs to be taught that hasn't already been taught in new modern distros because Mint is like two years old at data already, but they do it and it works for them, I guess. But again, it's not one of the distros that's run very much anymore because other things have taken its place that are much more new user friendly, which I appreciate seeing things change. Um, have you guys noticed that there's a trend with those people on YouTube that are like, I tried uh, Linux for 60 days, 30 days, 20 days, 100 and something days, and I had nothing but trouble and the distro that they always use is Linux Mint. <laughs> I wonder why that could be. Stop it, Reddit. But yeah, uh, I don't use any specific daily driver. I hit F11 on my keyboard when I turn on my computer in the morning, and I literally just do eeny, meeny, my eeny, meeny, miny, mo, and I see where it lands. And if it lands on the Ventoy USB, I do it again. Because that's always plugged in. Point being is, I'm probably going to be the first Linux YouTuber to ever say this, but don't limit yourself to one distro. Not unless you've already used almost every other distro. You know, like test multiple. Find out what works for you. Start a pro-cons list. Uh, stable list, like... Use it for 15 days, switch, use it for 15 days, make a giant list. Whatever one has the most pro of pros is the one you stick with. Me, they all have pros, they all have cons, they're all the same for me. But again, I don't daily drive any Linux distro.